Devin Campbell is one of the first to get a guided tour of the LGBT Network's new community center in Hop Hog. It's expected to be a new chapter for LGBT youth like him living on Long Island. This center helps mold and shape people to be who they want to be. For the last four years, the nonprofit has connected the Mastic Beach Man to peers going through the same thing he is, helping to feel less isolated. I've learned about other people's journeys. And their new 15,000 square foot building, which is the country's largest suburban LGBT community center, will help out even more. We wanted to say all gender restroom. The network's president is working with crews to put last minute touches on the building. The space is four times the size of their previous location. We had to turn people or turn events away um, in our Bayshore facility. We no longer have to do that. Thanks to donations and grants, he's turning their old Bayshore Center into affordable housing for LGBT seniors. In our golden years, people should be able to live their lives completely free and completely open. Their new Hop Hog Center will offer free HIV screening, a cafe, and has state-of-the-art community meeting rooms. You know, will help to develop that person in a healthy way as they grow up, uh, but also it helps them become an advocate for change. The network can now offer more programs. One is an after-school tutoring and career program that will help LGBT kids finish school called Pathways to Pride. 40% of LGBT students report being shoved uh, or pushed at school. Those kids uh, skip class or just drop out of school to avoid that harassment. It's just the opposite here. Everyone is welcome. Valerie Castro, CBS 2 News.